Hello and welcome to Team Catch and Release's exclusive Bankside interview with Avid Carp's media manager, Jason Umney. We locate Jason in stunning surroundings as he occupies the banks on RH Fisheries Stitch Lake during a 48 hour session with fellow Avid Carp consultant and Team Catch and Release associated angler Mark Woolley as the pair look to produce some articles and, some, and other publications for the angling media. Once the rods were out, we managed to sit Jason down and ask him a couple of questions. <laughs> Hang on, that couldn't have gone even any better for a try. Um, solid bag fishing, it's just incredible, you can cast them anywhere and the short rig and lead arrangement, I just think it hooks fish better than anything else out there. And not many people use it, so it's really underrated. Um, that's probably my first 30 from Manor at Linear. And it was the 1st of December, freezing cold. Yeah, that's one of the originals, 30 pounds, two ounces. And it was just one of those sessions that just, even though it looked bleak, managed to wink one out of the bag, just pure fluke. Single up bait cast onto a showing fish. Saw it roll and just whacked up bait onto it. Were you on your own? No, I was one of my, my mate Ben. He spotted the fish, which makes it even funnier. <laughs> he spotted it, pointed it out, and I cast on it and reaped the rewards. <laughs> and was he happy about that? Not really, no. Pub chuck. <laughs> just to never take your fishing too seriously and go for all the right reasons and enjoy it. Mm. Just enjoy your fishing and do what makes you happy. Don't listen to other people and don't, don't do what other people think you should do if you want to fish somewhere. Fish there. <laughs> Coffee. From the morning, um, pineapple pop-ups, or any high-vis type of pop-ups, and hobnobs. Um, I'm not really a riggy person, just a simple pop-up rig. Just a little bit of shrink tubing, blow-back ring, that's it really. Um, loads more exciting new products. There's lots and lots of stuff in the pipeline. And You're not allowed to have better stupid <laughs> no, <laughs> But loads and loads of good things. <laughs> Simple, um, relaxed, and happy. <laughs> <laughs> Bait, boilies. Like, I, I've always fished. Um, like bags and things like that, and you nick odd fish, but this year I've decided that I'm going to go for it with bait, whether it's particles, but just give it... If you, if I always think, if you look at all the, the, ang the big fish anglers out there, they catch lots of big fish, like Jim Shelley, people like that, they've all got, they all got one thing in common and they all use lots of bait. <coughs> Bitchiness. People who judge where you fish, the so-called fishing for wrong guns, and you shouldn't fish there because of this, you shouldn't fish there for that. Everybody's got their own reason to go fishing, everyone's got their own their right to fish where they want. And for people who judge where you fish, I think it's terrible. You should be able to fish where you want and not get asked any questions. <coughs> so I got to catch a 40 pounder, that'd be <laughs> nice. But just to, to be fair, I'd be happy if I just enjoy my fishing and catch a few fish. Yeah. Just, just, just enjoy it. <coughs> <laughs> Um, I haven't really, I've not really got a cat fishing hero to be fair because at the end of the day it's cat fishing in it but I'd probably say it'd have to be someone like Ian Russell, he'd love that but yeah probably Chemo, he's on him for years and he, he's one of the people who catches, constantly catches and gets them out of the bag mm. so he'd have to, he is one of the best out there. <coughs> just enjoy it and just do, just do what you're doing and just enjoy, don't get too wrapped up in taking it too seriously, just enjoy what you're doing, carry on doing what you do. To see how the guys got on in the remainder of the 48 hour session, you can check out the video blog which as always will be uploaded to the Catch and Release website as soon as the link becomes available. <laughs>